Welcome back to Sonic Frontiers. Yes. <laughs> there, uh, there was always one time where I just want the intro to be just dead silent. I think it would be really funny. But yay, more Sonic. Let's go. That's is that, that. There's dead silence and there's dead air. We can't have that. Oh, I know. I thought it was just funny because uh, since people know we're doing this over Discord, I thought it'd be funny if it's just like, uh oh. <laughs> Did I lose them immediately? Ah, it's funny well, every time. There's, there's only one thing you're losing, and that's this race! Oh, great. <laughs> I've, been, I've been just kind of, like, flowing through this race. I haven't even been considering it a race. I just want to play a good Sonic game. Yeah, um, and let's, let's get to it then. All right, I'm ready, and, uh... Oh, crap, I don't have the timer yet. With that being said, bring it on! <laughs> no, wait! <laughs> All right, three, two, two one, one, go! I just deck you across the face. Let's play some Sonic! Ugh! Come on! Okay, You're let's ready to see. Go! Oh yeah, I was in the middle of a starfall. Boom! Take a look at the old map here. What are we looking at? We got Chaos Emeralds for sure. Give me uh, got the those of the three out, oh, wait. purple That's right. coins. We got a stage we're going to. Cocos as well. Give me... Uh, Give me all the free cocos in the world. Where am I heading next? Free the cocos, man! All right, so a couple things were mentioned to us uh, regarding the new content that was added for Sonic's birthday. The Spin Dash. You have to complete all the timed missions in order to unlock the Spin Dash, but Drop Dash exists. Like, I think, Drop dash is what I was thinking of. Yeah, I think the moment that you hit the ground after jumping, you can get some speed for a drop dash. So that's what that's what I was thinking of too. Four five, go. You in four five? I'm I'm hitting I'm hitting up four five. Dude's in four five, trying to beat trying to win this race. Oh my gosh. We're us in four five! Four five! Oh, it's Green Hill. UDJ's forty five years old, what? Yeah, one day I will be. Yeah, and one day I shall follow. See, hey, it was it was somewhat that we have this time. it was somewhat funny to make those jokes back when we were like in our teens, but now it's just like okay, maybe maybe I should hold off on, <laughs> on making something yeah. like that. I, I, I oh, see you there, old timer. <laughs> <laughs> we're only two years apart. I don't know why I ever thought it was a good idea to make those. Because two years after I make fun of you, you could just go. Ah! And, I, and then I just got got. I'm just got forever. Oh well, yeah, I used to make fun of my dad for having like gray hair all the time. And uh, well, <laughs> well, I, I don't really make those. I, I don't make those jokes anymore. Yeah, like... Unless if I am also making them at my own expense. Hey, hey, hey Dad, I, I heard you're a big fan of salt and pepper. Well, guess what? I am now too. Uh, ooh. That's probably not Get out of here, you tower idiot! Get out of here. I don't want to fight you. But I will. Oh. I did. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> well, alright. That's generous. What'd you get? That easy S. Yes. Alright! I gotta find those last, uh, well, the first and last red rings. Is those right? last damn Chaos Emeralds? Oh, that's mucky water. Ugh. A speed dash. I don't need that. I need some hearts. There it is. Wait, no! Sonic! What? Sonic! Sonic! Why did you get the ring, you idiot? Why did you go back? That's one of my <laughs> favorite pastimes, is yelling, why Sonic, why? I don't know. I, I, I feel more connected to the game if I yell at Sonic, because, you know, he's... <laughs> he, he's the hedgehog. He's got it again. Yeah, yeah. He's the guy. He's the, He's guy. the guy we're playing as. That's right. Him. Oh, that was awesome. I just made a figure eight. Bet you can't make a figure eight. Nah, I can only do figure prime numbers. I can only do figure 17s. Oh. I hit an invisible wall. Where am I? Wait, what? I didn't hit like a like a barrier, I don't think. No! 
Oh, did they just forget to program that part? Uh oh, fine. I'll go the long way around. Maybe it's story locked or whatever. Yeah, oh, possibly. I don't know where you are, so maybe. I don't remember what areas are story locked. I know the um, the mission that has the chains around it. That's obviously story locked, but I didn't think an entire region was story locked. Oh well. I mean, there's more stages than normal in this one, so uh, we just gotta be. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, got it. I just gotta make it to the end. Get to the know, end. Hurry. Sega missed opportunity to have Sonic uh, give him the ability to hit one of the seagulls. Not like maliciously. It's more just like a love tap to a seagull that's flying over you. Why do you want to hit on seagulls? Oops, I mean, why not? It's my OC, dude. Don't make fun of my OC. Single the seagull. <laughs> yeah, I'm single the seagull. Please. <laughs> Please, no make fun, no bully. I wonder what your character theme song is. Probably, why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? <laughs> I believe you can proceed once you find a way to What was the name of the seagull from the Little Mermaid? Can I be him? Uh, sure would have been smoother sailing shit. if we'd been working together. Can I talk to start, seagulls but... about dingle hoppers? Well, I guess I had to earn your trust first, huh? Like, <laughs> like scuds or something, but I'm not. I got that. I don't. I don't remember. Do Who was he played by? It was a comedian. I figured out everything else up until now, haven't I? Uh. Don't sweat. Uh. 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 uh damn it! D Little oh, Mermaid was on. not the. That, that was not the one that I dedicated my trivia hours to. Why not? You was other... I'd be asking you about that. I yeah, you had no idea I was going to ask you about Little Mermaid <laughs> trivia. <laughs> it was other Disney movies I liked. I didn't. I mean, I actually like hated Little Mermaid as a kid because I was I was a young boy. What? Oh, yeah. Little Mermaid for years. I like Lion. I mean, it's it's not the it's not the best thing in the world, but it's. I like still Lion something. King. That's for furries. <laughs> That's my target demographic, yeah! Oh, that's hilarious. I, I don't know, I, I didn't get the appreciation for Little Mermaid until later in life. No. I mean, I, I was a weird kid who liked Black Cauldron at, at, as a kid, so... The Black Cauldron movie mine. The movie that almost bankrupted Disney because it was so... average? Think about what you just said there and how amazing... It, it was but not amazing that Disney almost went bankrupt. The fact that there was a possibility at one point. Well, they were their financial stability was a lot different in the in the, uh, in the 80s, though. Oh, yeah. Now they own everything. Uh huh. Well, Master Ninja chopped me up into the tiny thin slices. Some little Sonic sashimi. Let's try that again. I was trying to be more parry worthy, but uh, let's be a little more aggressive this time. My OC is Ow! Sashimi the Tuna. He just hit me in the face! Well, don't let him hit you in the face! I'm watching a bridge get created. Now he's blocking everything, and he's still hitting me! Would you please beat the ninja? He stun locks me. I can't do anything, and then, well, I'm, I'm dead again. The chaos emeralds with Blow it away with the cycloop, huh? You got All right. It, Sage. <laughs> We've run into each other so many times, but I only recently. Okay, let's try that shit. Could have told me sooner, you know. Is Sonic hitting on Sage? Cycloop away! No, meaning, no, he's always been trying to be like friendly towards her and all that, and this is just his way of still being friendly, I guess. The line "We've met so ne so many times, but I just recently learned your name" is such a rom-com line. Like Sonic is a pretty good judge of character, all things considered. So when so when he's like, "Hey, what's going on, crazy weird uh, cyberspace lady?" And, uh, he says it with and an endearing a attitude. See, see, he's trying to be, you know, cool and all that, you know, just tr trying to be friendly and, you know, uh, just uh, neighborly. And then she's all die, and he's like, "Whoa, what's what's your problem? Like, why, why do you hate me?" And, sh and she's like, okay, "I yeah, don't that's hate right. you, but I do wish we could become friends." And he's like, "Why don't we? Why don't we become friends?" And she's like, "No, die." What is your emotion? Mine's die. 
He's, he's a pretty cool guy. You know, Sonic... Uh, you know, Sonic... I, I think Sonic is out of character when he's being a douche. Uh, how often does that happen? I don't think I've ever seen Sonic as a douche. Sonic and the Black Knight. Oh, really? He's, he's, like, 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 he's not, like, you know, mean, he's just, but he's, like, you know, way too aloof that he comes off as kind of fucking uh, rude. okay. So, he, he's not acting like himself, he's a bit of a jerk-off in that one. They, they had nowhere to go, in terms of writing. Like, that's, how most scenes sad. go, it's like, Hey! Recognizable character that I know! Hey, recognizable character! A recognizable character goes, Huh? Who's that? I'm Arthurian legend character! And he's like, Alright, okay. whatever! <laughs> nice little Sonic Isekai going on right there. Recognizable characters, oh no. That's, I think that's what the storybook series were supposed to be, they're kind of like Isekais. I guess that makes sense. I bet if Black Knight was done a little bit better, I think we would have kept going with that. Maybe that's also one of the ingredients that led to Sonic Unleashed, because he's like going worldwide, and you know, these are kind of like worldwide stories and all Mr. that. Mr. Worldwide. You know? Worldwide! Mr. Sonic is the original Mr. Worldwide! <laughs> well, Sonic does turn into a pit bull, so I guess this tracks. Is this island done? I'm getting a lot of Sage talking in. And she's so fascinating. I just got one myself. Oh, yeah, let's talk about the Ancients. Hey, Sage, did you know it's almost Christmas? Oh, my God. Sonic, it's my. But it's almost Christmas. Just reminds me of the... Uh, the live-action Grinch film. It's like, one minute closer to Christmas! Damn it! I know oh, some people go. like that. Or like Nightmare Before Christmas. <laughs> There's only 365 days until next Halloween! 364! Yep. Yeah, it's, uh... Uh... Like, people in stores go ape for Halloween, and I completely understand. Because it's like awesome. Halloween it fucking is like rocks. Awesome. Halloween fucking rocks, man. Why do you think we have Halloween specials? And we've had like what, one or two Thanksgiving specials, and then we ran out of ideas and stopped <laughs> doing them. Well, that's because you found out what was it? A flash game? Pumpkin? That, that was the that was the framing device I gave it. So. Okay. <laughs> it's like that it's works. a it's a, it's a children's game about pumpkins. Let's make it about Thanksgiving. Why the fuck not? Yeah. Why not? Why not? Yeah. Sure. I seriously thought there was going to be something more to that, but it is literally no. Ew. Oh, more Tetris, great. No. And especially great when it's dark, when I have all these shades of light of uh, blue to work with. Oh, yeah, that's true. What other specials have we had? I mean, we've done April Fools a few times over the years. I mean, I remember when mine was a Madden game. I think we got, you know, the holiday specials, of course. Yeah. Actually, I think... Is is the Advent Calendar our first foray into Christmas specials? Because I don't remember anything specific before that, but then again, my memory is terrible. I think we did some stuff for, you know, the holidays. Mm -hmm. You know, something that could fit between schedules and uh, just, just for fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what Erica was supposed to be, and that game sucked. <laughs> I'm glad we only play good games now. I'm glad we only play Sonic games. <laughs> only Sonic games, that's it. Only Sonic, nothing else. Nothing else matters, actually. I know sometimes on my channel you see a little pink thing, but trust me, that's just uh, Sonic that's is just, hungry. That's just filler. That's just that's filler. It. It's, it, yeah. it's a Sonic OC. <laughs> Sonic's stomach burst out of his belly and became his own character. That's what happened. Nope, don't, don't like that. Don't like the wording of that one. The fuck? I found a stage. Oh, cool! I, I just go, go play that I just stage, tripped dude. into one. Yeah. Just oops, another stage. Good. <laughs> now I broke my leg, but at least I found a stage. <laughs> Way past cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's four two. Oh, you found four two? I found four two. Excellent. I have no idea which stage I'm on, but I hope I complete it first try. That would be such a flex. Yeah, what else is a flex? What that? Oh, dude, are you allowed to have guns on YouTube? Oh my god! 
No. Look at the guns. I mean, these are just model guns. It's it's just <laughs> anchor arms. Yeah, I feel that so bad. No, no, it's it's a model gun. No, no, it's it's fine. It looks exactly like it should. But, you know, it's, it's a couple things off about it. You can see the orange tip on it. And it's, it's, you know what? Let's stop talking. <laughs> Just the tip. Just the tip of my muscles. With anchor arms! Jeez. Oh, this is fast. It's so fast. It's so, so stressful. Oh, God. They fit on I've, like I'm, a glove! I'm, I'm getting nothing, and everything is bad, and oh, jeez. I have only missed one red ring. So I'm going it's to that one game. count my blessings here. All right. And there's the end. How'd I do? How did I freaking do? Okay. Is that good? Did I do good game? Oh, come on. Yes. Come Ooh. on. Okay. Now for the herring search for the rest of the red rings. Do Let's you want to take a guess as to how close I was to getting an S rank? Two minutes. Less. Uh, a hundred. Ooh, 52 milliseconds from getting that lovely S. Yeah, which means you, you hate just, to see it. You, you just have to do it slightly baby faster. Yep. And I think the worst part is I missed a red ring that was like directly in front of my face, and, the, and uh, because of that, I did not get the S. I don't know where these are. And I got hit points. twice by spikes. What is happening? I see. Where'd my skills go? Every time I play a Souls game, I ask that question. Where did my skills go? There's a, there's a third one. Are you doing okay over there? Uh, yeah, that, that's the word. Okay. I hear obscenity is in my Christian Sonic game, and I, I can't stand for it. Have you ever seen Christian Sonic memes? That Wait, those exist? Hold on. I this is new information. I can't tell how ironic or how sincere they are, because they, they look sincere, and that's kind of the, the, the beauty of it, but uh -huh. it's, it's literally just, you know, Sonic with the... Uh, with, with a cross necklace and praying and, no. you know, see. No! Way past cool! You know who else is cool? Jesus! Jesus! If I miss a oh fourth, my miss God. A fourth degree, I'm gonna be quite upset. That sounds hilarious. You know what? Like, Christian Camp Counselor Sonic is something I kinda wanna see. Oh no. There we go. Maybe, maybe Got you. It. Well, I mean, just like as a gag. I don't actually want to see it in the game. It's, it's just like, I'm, I'm visualizing it and it, it's making me giggle a little bit. That box you have sense. given me visuals that I can't unsee. Thanks a lot, buddy. Always happy to help. Actually, you know what? That perfectly describes uh, 12 years of doing LPs with you. You have given me imagery that I can, I cannot unsee. Well, that's, that's what I do best. I open people's eyes that they don't even know were closed. Or even they knew they had. UDJ opening third eyes? Oh, I don't oh open God. third eyes. I, I open like seventh eyes. Seventh? Oh, yeah. Okay, that was much better. You don't know how many eyes I got inside my head, dude. <laughs> I all, see. They all look at weird shit. Okay, can I just say... Seeing a perfect zero in the millisecond slot just looks so awesome. Well, yeah, because it's it, it's pleasing to the brain. It likes patterns mm. and clean mm, whole right numbers. There. That was two minutes, 30 seconds on the dot. Like, like your basic numbers. I mean, they teach kindergartners that you, you got to know your numbers. You got to yeah, know yeah, how yeah. whole numbers work. But when you when you get to like, you know, numbers that don't quite equal the number they're supposed to be in there, a different number. Well, uh, all right, let's have people who actually want to learn that stuff really. Uh, learn that when you take a look at the sequences it just it just fills in the brain matter and it just oh it looks cool would you believe i'm not a math guy seriously i am not a math guy i know you're a logic guy you like looking at you know uh, uh th this is gonna sound extremely stupid you are a lot smarter than me 
and you look at things at different angles when sometimes I only see it the one way. I I'm just got a perspective, but I do not like math. I, I, should, I should explain. I don't like conceptual mathematics. What's your subject? Like, which one did you excel at when you were in school? Science. Science? Okay. Science. That, science that is absolutely much if, tracks. Like, if I if I can use mathematics for science, then then we got something going. But mm. I have had the hardest time with mathematics in college and and uh, algebra and geometry. I cannot just like unless if it's something real and I can actually apply it to something. I, I I just don't care. Like functions? Who the fuck needs functions? <laughs> oh no! What? Screw functions! I hate functions. See, I. Okay, for some reason, like, math was my subject, but I couldn't get algebra. It killed me every time. But now I can, like, do quick mental math because I've set out to make it a personal challenge to be good at mental math. I don't want to rely on a calculator. So I'm really good at very quick equations, like, for all the different types of math, but algebra? Forget it. Geometry and trig I was good at. I, I never even took trig. Never. Uh, trig was an elective for me. It just, it was like, hey, you want to take trig? I was like, do I have to take more algebra? And they're like, nah. So I was like, okay, I'll take that. Like, I know en I know enough about mathematics to use, like, in a, in a basic sense. But just, it's yeah. a conceptual, it's the conceptual stuff I can't do. So uh, when I had my first uh, degree I was trying for in, in, in college, I had to take this uh, sort of, conceptual mathematics course or whatever it's 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 it, it was maddening and i failed it the first time and i got it like a like a, mm. a mid a mid c the second it was it was mad it was it was awful i did terrible but then when i changed majors it changed my math requirement to basically i tested out of it and don't gotta worry about that so i don't need oh, any nice. math now i took a statistics a, a statistics course and that was certainly fun I took an economics course, and that hurt my brain. It, you know what hurt, what hurt my brain the most? My mm. art philosophy class. Art philosophy? Yeah. Oh. I didn't know that was a thing. Let me, huh. let me ask you something. Yeah. What is art? <laughs> oh, God, no. Not a loaded question. It's open to interpretation. But that'll probably get me failed, right? Actually, no, because uh, we were... The whole point of that course was, uh, you know, asking what is art, and we're going through these uh, logical yet flawed um, I ideas for that. Hmm. And by the end of the course, it all came to, well, we don't know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, that was the end response? It's just like, oh, we don't know. I'm dumbing it down. I'm boiling it down to one statement. But oh, right. Yeah, of course. It was it was essentially, you know, who can say? It it is indeed open to interpretation. So really, you nailed it on you nailed it on the head there. Is it so, nice. is it something that elicits uh, an emotional response in people? Well, what about this thing that uh, doesn't is not meant to do that? It's just meant, right. it's just meant yeah, to be what there. What about this? You know, uh, and what about this? What about this? What about this? Well, this counteracts that. What about this? This sounds right. Well, this actually counteracts counteracts that. Do you count that as art? You know, or like, what's what is the difference between bad art and non-art? Oh, good lord! Ah. No. So whenever I hear I don't like, like that. whenever I hear these uh, hackneyed reviewers say it's not even art, I'm like, well, well, dude, mm. I, I hate to argue with you, I I really do. I yeah, really, unfortunately, really do. that right there, that's flawed. Ah, fuck. You're reminding me of the philosophy course I took. Have you ever taken philosophy? I took an art philosophy course. Just straight up philosophical views are bullshit. <laughs> Especially for the course I took. Okay, so for your art philosophy class, I kind of like the uh, the notion. It's just like, well, you got to have an open mind. You, you can't just say, oh, it's either this or that. It's not black and white. Like something as 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 uh, basal and, uh, and as human as art, it's hard to nail it down to one specific Webster's de definition of it. My philosophy professor... I hated that guy because one of the first things he said to us when we came into the course is like, yeah, just to let you know about uh, 
about 75% of the people who take my class fail, wow. so they look forward to that. And I was like, oh, good! Is it because of the course because of you, buddy? Uh, yeah, we were starting to think about that. He was a very monotone, you know, dilly gaff kind of guy. So, yeah, I, uh, I managed to pass. I'll, I'll take it. I got a 2.1 on it... Rate My Professor, but who cares? Yeah, pretty much. Like, he would, I would ask him a question, and he would just go, well, think about it for a second. <laughs> There's a reason I'm asking you for help! I don't know how you want me to think! Ah, uh, oh, disgusting. Alright, I can't parry lasers. That's, that makes sense. Yay, I did it. Alright, All right, you need to slow down, you motherfucker. Yeah, Are you talking you, to me? Yeah, you, no, not you. You talking to me? Not you. You talking this, to me? This, this red pillar guy I'm fighting. You're telling me I should slow down? I'm Sonic the freaking Hedgehog. You think you can tell me to slow down? See, this is when Sonic goes to a cafe in LA, or he gets pulled over by the cops. It's just like, do you know who I am? Now, there's only one thing that Sonic has ever said slow down to in his whole life. You know what that is? Uh, Amy. Uh, that's all of the 10 out of 10 reviews for Sonic Frontiers on Metacritic! Oh. <laughs> There's too many, guys! Please, let's give other games a chance! Bit. I mean, come on! We gotta give Tears of the Kingdom some credit! I'm sure I'm sure Starfield has it run enough room for one <laughs> 10 out of 10. It might be shit, I don't know. What, what, what's, the, what's that meme that's out there right now? It's just like, oh, the, the kids have had their time, now it's time for the adults to play or something like that. You just see uh, Sonic Front or uh, Tears of the Kingdom is baby game, and then you have Sonic Frontiers is <laughs> adult game. Hilarious. It is. It is mature. <laughs> no, I, bet, I bet you didn't know this is borderline T-rated. Borderline T-rating. Well, shit. Although I need to get in on that. Never forget though that Zelda went T-rated before Sonic did. Uh, Twilight Princess, if memory serves. Correct. I love that shit. For gave, shocking he... imagery, I believe. Like, that's that's gotta be really demeaning. Even when Sonic gets a gun and starts saying curse words and has like you know terrorist attacks on major cities, he still can't get a T rating. He still can't. Get he still can't get that edgier T rating. Oh, that's adorable, Widow Hedgehog. I'm gonna oh kill God. all the damn humans. Ugh. Oh, that's that's cute, Shadow. I, I got, I got Power you. Man 5000 on my soundtrack. <laughs> Oh, that's adorable. Hey, hey, everybody, get a load of the hedgehog over here thinking he's M rated material. <laughs> Our opening theme has e Sonic plus? getting hurt really bad and falling. And <laughs> take us seriously! <laughs> Please, take us seriously! And then Sonic 06 came out, and uh, I give that a rating oh. of uh, rated N for nobody. <laughs> nobody wants to play that garbage, except I do. I will be the one to defend Sonic 06 as How a playable fuck piece do of I fucking hit this trash. This fucking piece of shit. Bolt. There we go. Hey, hey, hey! Sonic game, please. T-rated language, please. Yeah, uh, whatever. He could say motherfucking have Amy just get fucking stark naked, and that's how he'd finally get his T rating. <laughs> It'll never happen. I mean, look at that. It'll Princess Sally happen. basically had no clothes on for the entirety of her TV run, and that's, I know. that's for kids. And thus, the awakenings happened in droves. Okay, can I let you in on some really, f something really funny that happened? What's that? <laughs> uh, Pokemon got official forums. Oh no. They're not moderated. Oh, bad idea. So one of the first few threads that showed up is like, I'm secretly attracted to Gardevoir. Yeah, I knew it was gonna be Gardevoir. Which, it's always fucking which Gardevoir. Which Pokemon trainer's the hottest? Which one would you tickle first? And it's just like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> no! It's either Gardevoir or Lopunny. Those are like the Renamon of the, of the of the Pokemon universe. <laughs> the easiest targets. Where are my muck people at? Come on! Like, who doesn't want to snuggle with Snorlax? Please! Get these forums fixed, Nintendo. We need the actual questions to be asked here. Lopunny? Nah. Nah, garbage. Throw? There you go. Mm. I love me my my. If I can find me a Bert and Ernie that can kick my ass, hell yeah. 
Do some of that throw and sock action. When you throw my socks, they're like frisbees. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Ew. Oh, you truly are a Sonic fan. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Uh, well, we got about a minute left, uh, thankfully. I'm just screwing around because accidentally I finished every challenge, so I have the whole map. Shit! Oops. I got, I got like one more. I th yeah, one more probably. Yeah, you should be pretty close. We were pretty evenly matched. Seventy-six. Do, do have a stage I can go to? Um, all right. Uh, how many emeralds you got? Uh, I. Th uh, how many do I have? I've got five. I've got five as well, and I can get my six, apparently. Yeah, same here. Uh, let me... Let me find this stage. I found four or five, so I know exactly where you were. Nice. This is close. So now... Is it all gonna come down to talking to Sage? Oh, God, it is, isn't it? Please it is. let it, it come down to talking to Sage. Oh no! Again, that's I think that's kind of the kind of the beauty of this. You can just kind of run around, and do your own thing, and you still kind of complete around the same time. I don't know. You had a pretty defeatist attitude last time we played. It's just like, oh, I'm not actually racing anymore. I'm just enjoying the game. I'm still enjoying the game. <laughs> but and and even I'm just you know kind of still not relaxing. It's still gonna get down to neck and neck at the I end. Know. I know. I love it. It's so funny. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and open up the stage and just kind of like stand around. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm killing this Kunoichi and I'll call time. Okay. Nice. nice. Got him. Well, now that I can jump around willy nilly, I just need to figure out where to find all the heart icons. 180 right. rings, S rank, four five. Okay. All Couldn't right. So you, bad, you've, but we'll see what happens. You, you've hit a spot. Correct. I'm standing right outside of stage. All right, I've got, I've got, I think what looks like my last challenge in the distance. I mean, it looks. Oh pretty, God! <laughs> it looks pretty last. So we're gonna be jumping through hoops. We're gonna be talking to Sage hardcore. Talking to Sage. Oh my I God! Think, I think we're gonna do another podcast episode next time because just gonna be running around getting challenges yep. and talking to Sage. And oh, I found uh, three gear. Jesus. Uh oh. Well. We've still got plenty of Sonic Frontiers left to go, it sounds like. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, well, I can't wait. I'm, I'm having a good time. It's, it's going yeah, to be a good ride. All right. We'll see you next time.